Hello, this is Mike Weber. Today we are going to take a look at using video backgrounds in your presentations. First we will go to Presenter Media and select a video background. We have many to choose from. I selected Soaring Clouds. You will notice on the right here there are four different formats. The WMV Windows Media file is great for PowerPoint on PC, while well, we have QuickTime, best for Mac or Keynote, Flash if you're working in a Flash-based application, and this PPTX PowerPoint slide format you want to embed into your PowerPoint template. I'm currently working on PowerPoint 2013 using Chrome as my browser. I'm going to go ahead and select the Windows Media Player version and download that. You'll see a tab form here at the bottom. With Chrome it automatically has saved it into my downloads folder. You may be using Internet Explorer or another browser and it asks you where to save it to. That's not a problem. Go ahead and save that in a folder on your system that you choose. At this point we'll go back to PowerPoint and I'm gonna go ahead and select another slide to insert here you will see we have a, this blank slide there's this open area here I'm gonna go ahead and delete that we can then go ahead and insert video and then go ahead to where you saved it at here we go I'm gonna go ahead and insert that you'll see that it takes up the whole box at this at this point we have our video inserted into our presentation. There are a few different things we can do. Uh, you'll notice when we highlight the video, uh, video tools will appear, playback options. You can go ahead and click so the video will loop until stopped. And you can have it automatically start. Another thing, you may want to put a title on this page. Go ahead and just right click you can send the video to the background and your placeholder is available again so you can go ahead and put in a title you can also click reset the slide and you'll notice the other placeholder is available again and at this point we can go ahead and take a look at our presentation. Go ahead and start the slideshow. There's our first slide. And there's our title with our video running. And you'll notice at the bottom it should restart and just continue. And thank you for listening.